What's something me and this piece of billet aluminum have in common? We're both sick. Yeah, you like that? You like that. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to part two of our mini series on billet aluminum. I'm sure some of you are wondering where Andrew is. He's no longer with us. He's moved on to better things. He's a professional bodybuilder. He followed his dreams and he succeeded. But upon doing so, he will always have to live with the fact that he will never be able to break apart this billet aluminum block, no matter how strong he is. Because we got the goods. The process of making billet aluminum is hot and heavy, but it yields tough results. By smelting, folding, and forming aluminum in and on itself, you create billet blocks and rods, which is what we make all of our products from. It's from this process which billet gets its strength and durability. Billet has become used in various industries, such as construction, electronics, and appliances, along with many others. So of course, it was a no-brainer that we chose billet over every other aluminum out there. And with billet aluminum being so tough, it's a common question we get of how we manage to manufacture our parts effectively and so precise. Our next video will tell you all about that, so make sure you stick around and subscribe for part three, where I take you to the CNC machine shop. Right there. That's from this. Oh, dude, it's on there. Oh my god. <laughs>